Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Haka in the H&M and Edgar Ngu, they will never fight physically. Never. But the people who follow them behind, they are the ones that will be fighting. So, if somebody has wisdom, and the only one who should apply that wisdom is Ed Galungu, because Ed Galungu has ruled before. So you would rather just withdraw. You would rather just withdraw and allow other people to come in. As long as he's there, they will be fighting. And those fighting will go down to the, to the people. Wisdom. Let's look for peace. What, how will that peace come about? That peace will come about by, by Edgar Lungu stepping down. Would it be wrong for him to step down? No, it is not wrong. It is wisdom. Because he has had an opportunity. And there are other people that can come in. Than him continuing fighting, fighting. And some of you, you would say, no, I mean, uh, uh, HH is being unjust and so on and so forth. Let's be very honest. Let's be very, very honest. We know that PF did not rule this country uh, with integrity. No, let's not be, let's not lie. PF, there was corruption in PF. And by Edgar Lungu, but Edgar Lungu cannot stand up and say, I came out clean. No. No. He can't. He can't. He can't. He can't. I can tell you that. He can't. But Edgar Lungu cannot come out and say, no. I was exceptional. I never engaged in corruption. There is nothing that happened with, without uh, whatever. No, you can't. You can't. And some of us, we know some of these things. We know. Some of us, we know these things. We know. And even some of you, somebody was calling me yesterday. No, you are exposing Balungu. I'm not exposing Balungu. I am not exposing Balungu. I am not exposing Balungu. I am not exposing Balungu. If, you were to, if I were to expose Balungu, I mean, I would bring up a case here that all of you cannot challenge. If I were to expose Walungu, I can bring up one case that all of you here cannot challenge. All of you here cannot challenge. So, even as you are criticizing me, you should bear in mind that Walungu Ndabashamo, because I love him, because I ate with him on the same table, I shouldn't be the man that should come out to say, no, 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 hey, let this happen to him, hey, let him go to prison. No, no, I will not do that. I will not do that. I am simply criticizing his position in politics. That is my that is my issue. His position in politics. But Brian, very me. Uh, at what case? <laughs> you are Dao. You are Dao, Brian Musa, to ask me to say what case? Because I'm basically telling you to say I can bring one case, but I'm not doing it. But then you ask me what case? That is being Dao. You can't ask such a question. Such a question is asking out of who, you know, being dumb. I'm saying I can't I can't bring up because then I say what case? That is being dumb. And I'm not going to go that route because of the love that I have for my Edgar Lung. And because I've eaten before him. And of course, I may not have benefited as much as other people did, but certainly the point is that uh, I, I did benefit uh, in in one way, uh, in some ways, in some ways. My point is simply to say, let him get out of politics. And this is not because HH has paid me to tell him that. 
No, it is based on the fact that number one, but Edgar Lungu can never get power from Haka in the issue. Number two, they will we will not have the peace. We will not have the peace. And we will not ha we will not be able to move forward properly with Haka in the Hichilema uh, and Ed Galungu fighting. We will not have that peace. Thirdly, it is only by Haka by Ed Galungu. If this fight continues, it's only by Ed Galungu who will cry. It is only by Ed Galungu who will suffer out of this fight. It is only by Ed Galungu. Don't be cheated. Don't think that uh, no, uh, Edgar Lungu is so clean and whatever, whatever. Mm -mm. It's not true. It's not true. It's not true. But Edgar Lungu can suffer out of all this. And if he continues, I can assure you, he will suffer. But he will suffer and not get power at the end of the day. And I believe I agree with uh, with the Paramount Chief Mpezeni when he says, "Let him give him, let him give the incumbent space to do." He is making mistakes, but let us criticize those mistakes. Let us criticize those mistakes. But to add on the Edgar Lungu, I think it's a wrong, it's a wrong move. It's really a wrong move. But Ed Galungu should stay away from politics. Not because I've got any ulterior motive. No. It is for his good. And it is for the good of this country. Chief Mpezeni is right. And I will find time to go and visit him and apologize for the words that I said uh, some time back. I know some of you will say, whoa, 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 whoa. Whatever. That's okay. I've given you my opinion. So far, the one who is not being fair to this country and to himself is Ed Galungu. If Ed Galungu pulls back, I think then we can start now talking to her, Haka in the HDMI, to say, please, leave the statesman. Let him be. But as long as he's in politics, it will be very difficult for us to criticize Haka in the HDMI. Because we already have a history, and we can't force Haka in the Hichilema to, to treat Ed Galungu in a particular manner which he himself did not create. I know he's a former president, Haka in the Hichilema was not a former president, but when you talk about rights, it doesn't matter whether you are a former president, you are not a president, I mean, rights should just be given. But did Haka in the Hichilema get those rights during the time of? Edgar Chagwalungu, he did it. Can we force Haka in the Hichilema to give by Edgar Lungu those rights? I doubt. I doubt. The best that a man should do, withdraw. Maintain the status of former head of state. Let him be given that respect. And then we can nicely talk about uh, defending when he's treated badly by the current government. So far, by Ed Galungu is in active politics, and it is a pity that he continues even receiving the benefits of former head of state when he's active in politics. He is active in politics, and don't push us, don't push us too far to to that level. Because if you start saying no, no, he's not in politics, then you are pushing us. You are pushing us. You know, what are you going to do? If you start pushing us, no, no, he's not in active politics, not in active politics. You are pushing us. You are pushing us now to start bringing out things to prove that he's is in politics. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Savage. All right, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.